Dr. King's words about equality, justice, and peace having special significance this MLK Day for a whole new generation. WLWT News 5's Christy Davis leading the way with the lessons learned today. Today's theme was looking back and moving forward. It really was an attempt at connecting the generations through Dr. King's legacy. School was out, but teachers and parents made sure learning didn't stop on Martin Luther King Jr. Day. I think it's important to kind of be engaged and uh, do this kind of thing, especially when you're young. And the students we talked to wanted to be a part of it all. We came down here to spread Martin Luther King's dream. But what will that look like for this generation? At the awards breakfast before the march, Freedom Center Director Dr. Clarence Newsom said it could come in the form of a proven tool. Civil disobedience against unjust laws can truly bring about social transformation. We see young people actually uh, using those strategies right now. In his keynote speech, Dr. Newsom pointed out struggles of the civil rights movement still left to overcome. What were those issues then? The war on poverty, a growing underclass. The teens we talked to said they pay close attention to those issues, along with the events in Ferguson, Missouri, New York, and even here in Ohio. But they agree that peace is the only way forward. Trying to come together as one, getting more, a lot of people to come together and just celebrate. And I just think that it's important not to have hate and to just kind of be more peaceful about it. So it's just something to remember. A lesson that could help us all march towards a brighter future. Chrissy Davis, WLWT News 5. Thousands of people marked today by performing service projects all across the tri state. And it's not too late to get involved if you want to. Just go to our website, wlwt.com, right now for a list of ways to give back even when you are busy.